Hey everyone, it's Wingspan TT, and today I'm going to be doing my third and final Ouya Games Impressions video. Why is it going to be my final Ouya video? That's because I'm going to be giving away my Ouya Game Console. This one right here. Now I know what you're thinking. You're asking yourself, is that console haunted? Because I've read a lot on the internet that the pre-launch Kickstarter-backed Ouya consoles are haunted. But I assure you, this console is totally fine. It has not kept me up at night with moaning, crying, and stabbing sounds. It hasn't done anything like levitated off the ground, or turned off the electricity, or anything like that. And it certainly hasn't injected a constant sense of dread and fear into my home that is driving myself, my spouse, and even my pets insane. I just really need to, I just, I, I just want it out. I want it out. I want to get rid of it. And I want you, I want you, my loyal viewers, to have it. Please. So stay tuned through the rest of this video, and at the end, I'll tell you how you can win your very own Ouya console that isn't haunted. Now, it's been a little time since I turned my Ouya on, and I had to install a lot of updates, but I'm going to jump in here, find some new games, check them out, and uh, especially now, since I'm not going to have my Ouya anymore, um, and, you know, it's sure the haunting is a little, I mean, there's no haunting. There's no haunting. There's featured games of your slime ball. Um, I'm going to have to pick this up. Just because if this is what I think it is, then I need to play it. Um, my roommate in college was obsessed, obsessed with a game called Slime Volleyball. And if this is that game, I think um, I'm going to need to play it. So we'll download that. Let's see. Trending now. What is this? This looks like it has good graphics. Now it's probably just the image there. All right. Some kind of... Oh, I remember. Okay. I think I've seen stuff. All right, let's, let's get this thing down, too. Let's download that as well. 356 megabytes. But thankfully, with the power of Comcast Internet, that's just going to fly right by. All right, let's not. Let's see. We got genres. We got play like Bob. Don't know what the hell that's supposed to mean. Apple Dog Games Dev Playlist. We played a couple of these last times. We played Cannibal. We played Ice Rage. We did not play Shadow Gun. Out of the box. Games that defy convention. None of them. None of the devs could think out of the box. Good fucking job, devs. You just had to keep making first-person shooters and platformers. Seriously, our founders, the true believers. All right, so these are people who uh, founded Boo Ooh, yeah, I guess. Do you sleep? The hell is that? The hell is this? Do you sleep is a white noise app that allows you to customize backgrounds that to listen to while relaxing or going to sleep. No, why the fuck? I'm not playing that in my video. Choplifter, Mini Gore, Escape Artist. Okay, only on a... I have to say, though, right off the bat... Um, I have to say that with the latest updates, this this console is moving a lot faster. I remember there being a lot more menu lag the last time I was playing. Like I would hit the up button, it would take like just a perceivable second or so for things to change. What is this? Order and Chaos Online, which is a multi-platform MMO. I believe you could play this between um, Android devices. You can play it on uh, Windows Phone devices. Play it on all kinds of stuff. It'll do. It'll do. Okay, what's this? This looks like some... What is the fuck? Okay. It's like an adventure game. That's going to take too long. Take too long. FPs for Ouya. It's probably Sonic the Hedgehog 4. Sonic CD. Let's play the good Sonic CD. Let's play the good fucking Sonic game. I'm not playing Sonic the Hedgehog 4. Download that too. Um, it's not that I have anything against Sonic the Hedgehog 4. It's just that it is supposedly terrible. Um, you know what? You know what? I could always ruin. You know, here's something we should play. You don't know Jack. You don't know Jack. This is something I grew up with. The You Don't Know Jack series has been around. Yes, it's been around that long. I remember playing my first You Don't Know Jack games back in like 1997. Um, so I'm at the very tail end of the millennial group, according to NPR. And uh, we'll, we'll download that too. And then Bomb Squad is supposedly the best game. Now, I don't know how many games I intend to play here. Use your PS3, Xbox controllers, iOS, and Android devices as controllers. Blow up your friends in a tournament of mini games. Okay, so I don't have any friends. Not going to happen. But it's got 2,000 upvotes. I, I assume it's good. I think, and there's Sonic the Hedgehog 4, Episode 2. So, oh! 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 Wow, is there even any point to playing the other games? Raiden Legacy, ladies and gentlemen. Raiden being the greatest, the greatest, in my opinion. Vertical scrolling shoot 'em up of all time. Yeah, you've got Ikaruga. It's beautiful, it's well designed, and all that crap. You got all the nostalgic shit from like the NES and Super NES that people love. But Raiden 
Legacy, Raiden Fighters, Raiden Fighters Aces, all these games are, uh, they're just so fun. They're the most, you know what, I'm just doing it, doing it. Reagan, Raiden Legacy, Raiden Legacy has nothing to do with more combat. We'll say the best for last, I'll play the other games I downloaded first. So let's go, see if any of them finish downloading. Can I play this yet? Play, let's, no, okay. Well, I don't know what happened. I hit, I hit a button. Now someone told me a double tap the Ouya thing to exit and it just came up on the screen. In my earlier videos, you'd see me trying to press the button, hold the button, do all kinds of funny button stuff. It didn't work. So I'm going to try to spend about like, I don't know, five minutes in each game, something like that. We're just going to play a one player game. Is it, does it have to be two players? Oh, god damn it. No, you can't play against AI? Is this a joke? This is a joke. This has to be a sick joke. You have to play two players. God damn it. Okay, well, look, um, all right, let's see here. What, what else is in my library? Let's see if I can sell their stuff finished downloading yet. So Slime Ball finished downloading. Wrathborn has finished downloading. Let's see it. Let's see. Now, this is supposed to be kind of like Diablo, except for the Ouya. It is apparently run on Unreal Engine, and uh, people are trying to explain to me what the the Unity Engine was last time. Unreal Engine, Unity Engine, Cry Engine. I didn't learn all that stuff. I don't know how many cylinders any of those engines have. Look at, by the way, look at these amazing options, ladies and gentlemen. Like, I came here in the options menu. Here are the options. Leave the options and mute sound. That is some dynamic shit right there. Um, so I'm not incredibly impressed right off the bat. Looks like we got slave slots. So I'm going to be using up one. The elders say that life was not mm. always like this. The old legends tell of a time when magic and monsters were once children's stories. Mm -hmm. When we ruled from great cities of steel and stone. Oh shit, this takes place in the future? Then, the magic returned. No! No! Guys, get in your bunkers fast! Don't you hear? All this is the future, holy shit! Race, Someone is using the Android device to send messages power. back to us, to warn us but what we need to do. That truly believe these oh, tales. god damn it. Now, okay, yeah, we get it, okay, yes. The future's ruined, future's forsaken, I remember. Okay, so, you don't pick a class or anything like that. Here's a guy, he's got attack, he's got strong attack, okay. Oh, now it's gonna tell me, sure, yes. Figure that part out already, bro. Really to party and press on all the other stuff, see what happens. Okay. The Y button doesn't do anything. The triggers don't do anything, but probably because I don't have like skill. Wait, oh, whoa, trigger was doing something. Okay, it's like healing or something. It's doing something. I'm charging up. Alright, so we'll figure this out. I'm sure it'll tell me. So this is attack. So I'm gonna attack this thing. Alright. Light attack, heavy attack. Already two steps ahead of you, bro. Two steps ahead of you, bro. Okay, and is this good? Do I want that? Alright, I assume I want whatever that glowy thing is on the ground. Heavy attack! Oh! Oh! Come on, you fucking... And then shield power. Press and hold L2 button to activate shield power. Okay, got it. So this is your shield. I don't know, what, does it just shield me from attacks? I'm level 1. So far I'm liking this. Alright, All right, let's see if it works. Alright. I blocked one attack already. Nothing is happening though. He's just kind of standing in awe of my shield power. Maybe, oh, I see. I have those shield icons at the top. So basically, okay. So basically, by activating shield power, got it. Breakables, got it. Oh, so just like in real life, breaking things is the most productive way to make it through your day. Breakables. I just feel like contract. Hey, look, society collapsed. I don't have to worry about breaking things, right? What's going to happen? The police are going to come get me? There's no goddamn police anymore. There's no America. There's no Syria or Libya. There's no China. There's no Israel, Palestine. In a way, this is kind of like a paradise future. There's no more superpower countries that all hate each other. Uh, it's really great. It is really great. You just sit around. You just walk around with a giant fucking mallet and break things. Sounds like a paradise to me. Uh, all right, here we go. This is kind of cool, though. I have to give them some credit for kind of setting in this post-apocalyptic world. Having the railroad tracks here, like, that's a little, that's a, that's a thing where I feel like you might not even just notice right away. I see, so your shield regenerates over time. All right. And I, I am not having that much health. Do I have some kind of combo or something? Yeah, but you keep hitting it, you do combos. I don't know if I regenerate my health. Apparently, oh, you regenerate shields towards blue orbs you pick up because shields are blue. I get it. All right. Oh my god, I'm not colorblind. I guess I'm thankful for that. Oh! Didn't fucking know, bro. Oh, did you see that? I'm getting like a combo on strong attacks. You have reached a new okay, level excellent. Of power. Level up. Do I get anything? Do I just get more powerful or what? 
This guy, apparently they get stunned if they attack you in certain... Okay, here we go. What, is this a boss? Fuck, it's a boss already! Please don't be like the boss. Dead scrolls. Where's the boss? Where's the boss? Where's the boss? Come on. That is not a dragon. Not that I expected to be a dragon. Anyone who watched my Dead Soul video knows what the hell I'm talking about. Oh, he, this guy does not have a lot of health. Oh shit, oh! So if you tackle the shield's power up, then that's when you get the stun and you can basically get free attack. Okay, I, I see now. I see now. If I can heavy attack through it, I just can't like light attack through it. Oh shit! I just got get my ass kicked. Right, here we go, not really though. He died in like four hits. All right, so you get the green orbs, you get more health. You get the blue orbs, you get more shield. If you go through this gate, is it breakable? No, come on, of course, this unbreakable gate there. I th this guy kind of looks like a barbarian. Channeling, press and hold the shield button in the rune circle to open the gate. Okay, makes sense. Obviously, obviously, that's kind of cool. I like it. Very cool. Next, we've got new rune unlocked. I don't even know what the hell that means. You have destroyed the Mara Raiders in killing the Mara Chieftain. You have gained great power. You can bend the runes to your will with but a thought. Any enemy close by can be harmed by the magical blast okay. All right. you can Sounds unleash. Cool. And now the way lies clear. Okay, great. All right, start game. All right, so that was not a game before. That was all a joke. Let's see here. I got skills. You have unlocked a new skill. Hmm. Hammer smash. You makes sense. Strong. Quick combo. Oh oh oh. Power attack. Why? All right, sounds good. And let's see, you get dodge, you get whirlwind, you get heavy combo, and radial smash. That all sounds very, very cool. 20 maximum levels. And so you can get different weapons, basic weapon. You can get the rage storm. Oh, they're all hammers, though. I was hoping that you could get, like, different types of weapons. Preview, do I just get it? Oh, I see, it shows you what it'll look like when your character's holding it. Got it. Oh, okay, and it's a free game. You get gems, got it. So let's just uh, jump in here. Let's just jump in. All right, we'll play one more map and then I'm done with this game. So right off the bat, I am very impressed that this game is like cool. So how do I, it's, it says I have a magic power. Is it just, okay, channeling, got it. Okay, defeat three ways, no, no, that's not, I, I wouldn't have done it if I knew that's what it did. Okay, here we go. All right, all right. See, here's the thing, when you see you get the pickups that are like more um, shield oriented pickups, so what is this why what is this do? Oh yes! That's what I'm talking about. When I was in school and they asked me what did you want to be when I grew up, I said I want to be hammer wielding barbarian. Everyone laughed. But who's laughing now, Miss Miller? Who's laughing now? Oh. Probably not Ms. Miller, because based on the time of day, she's probably just like sleeping right now. Like it's kinda late. But I was gonna guess if she were still awake. Okay, I don't know what the charging. Uh, see, okay, you get surrounded. I like this. This is cool. I I'm just trying to figure out if my attacks have some kind of radius to them. Or if I basically... Okay, very cool. Wave complete. Very good. Getting some health, getting some shield. Just trying to get me to go in here. I'm one of those players that never just does what it says. Like, I always want to look around and see, like... Oh, what? What? They're just going to keep sending waves at me? Is that it? I guess I'm getting a lot of experience. Oh, oh, oh! There you go. See, look at that. New level of power. Oh, I like went pretty far that time. Oh god, I'm taking so much damage. Okay, here we go. How about that? How about what do you how do you think of what do you think about that? I feel like I could just go forever. This is getting kind of easy actually. All right, here we go. Enemies. All right. Oh. Yeah, I can hit multiple people once. This is very cool. You would expect it'd be kind of lame if you had this giant fucking hammer and you couldn't hit multiple people. Oh shit, I'm just taking all kinds of damage. If you couldn't hit multiple people at once, it'd be kind of lame. Alright, here we go. Fast combo seems kind of overpowered. Like, you just kind of interrupt them. But I guess when your enemies get the shields, then you're in trouble. Alright, alright. That's enough grinding for me. I think it's time to uh, to get out. Is this a breakable? No, it's a walk-throughable. It's a clip-throughable item. <laughs> oh, fuck! Oh no, there's more. I gotta break these guys up. That's what I have to do. Kind of like separate them. All right, separate them out. Gotta keep them separated. Oh, <laughs> you're spinning around. You're wielding a hammer and you're knocking them down. Oh, come on and play. Do do do. Oh, that thing's fucking scary looking. 
Oh, shit! I didn't know there were enemies with, like, they destroyed on... Oh, I gotta use my shield power in those things. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Shield. Okay. Shield is good. Shield is good. My, my, my triggers get stuck there. It's not working right. Or I just don't understand the fundamentals of this game. That is legitimately possible, by the way. Oh, no, no! Oh, no! Fuck! Oh, come on! Come on! No, you know I'm done with this game. I'm done with this game. I'm done. I take back everything good I said about this game. Take it all back. All right, let's play a different. Let's play a fair game. All right. All right, let's jump into you don't know Jack. And if you're not familiar with this game, it is, <laughs> it is a trivia game uh, with attitude. It's basically a trivia game that has no respect for Logos you. Logos are on standby. Lose legal. Q logo, please. I just had to shut up a little bit. You just have to enjoy this a little bit. Do they still have Cookie? Is Cookie still? Startup game activation is live. Who's the host for this game now? See, and this game is so great because it's, it's the kind of game where I'm pretty sure if you just sat here and never pressed the button, it would start screaming at you or cursing at you or things like that. But I'm not going to sit you through that. We're just going to go. Okay, we're set. Honey, All right, look at this. So you can play on your phone? Whoa. I can't believe you give my console away now. No, I didn't know this. I didn't know I could let my friends play with me on their phone. God damn it. Ugh. See, watch this. It's a new name. You put in your name, right? If you tried to put in a, a curse word name, if I remember from uh, back in the day, it's going to have a pretty hilarious response. I'm only doing this not because I'm an immature asshole, but because I want you to see what happens. Play. Press the play. We're going in 30 seconds. Hi there, I'm Johnny. If you like, I can explain the instructions to the best of my Yeah, let's just do it for the people at home. If you do, then percolate on this. Many questions will prevail themselves upon you. You need to wingle out the correct choice and impress the I'm going to be hugely to disappointed if it doesn't do anything with my name. It, there is a time in the original You Don't Know Jack, it would do things like if you put a curse word as your name, name, it would penalize you. You start the game with minus $5,000. Hey, or if you... Really? 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 Now your name is Tickles. <laughs> Just because. Ten seconds. Be careful out there. Uh, somebody check the doorbell. All right, doing exactly what I thought. I I even remember. Um, Three. Oh shit! I just don't want to tell stories. I want to hear what they say. I am Cookie Masterson, and if you love trivia, cookie. this love game cookie. is for you, and also for this trivia-loving duck. Playing alone, are we? Don't worry, I'm here. And your wrong answer of the game is being sponsored by Finger of the Month Club. Because it's easier than going out month after month and finding fingers yourself. I don't know. <laughs> okay, let's get this What I learned in the Big Lebowski is pretty easy to get fingers, pinkies, anything like that. Whenever you want. Number one. Here we go. Let's see how smart I am. To let's see if I got this. Where there's a lil, there's a way. Yeah, come on, dude. Do it Okay, cookie. pay attention and question. tell me this. What would be an example of Lil Wayne in a Lil Wayne? What? Lil Wayne in a little ship? Lil Wayne in a little cabin? Fuck, Lil I don't Wayne know any... What? Airplane, or Lil Wayne in a Lil Wagon? Oh, oh god, I'm a lot dumber than I thought I was. Oh, uh, I'm guessing ship. I think you're a little confused. No, what? One right answer coming up. I don't even know what the hell that is. is a large farm wagon used to haul hay and other large loads. <sighs> All right, not looking good so far. Not, I'm not Lil not smart with those. pulled by a donkey, so parallel parking is a nightmare. Negative nine hundred dollars. Wonderful. That ass up. <laughs> oh my god! Here we go. All right, let's I do this. this one. Grandma's Chinese, Chinese penitentiary. penitentiary. All right. No. 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 I don't know what that is. I don't know what it is. Get this one correct, and I just might see my way to offering you early parole and 1,000 extra bucks. All right, let's do it. Arrange these celebrity jailbirds. And oh, my God, no. I'm not going to be able to do this. From shortest time to longest time. Robert Downey Jr., Martha Stewart, Mike Tyson. Stewart Tyson Downey, Tyson Downey Stewart. Stewart Fuck. Downey, Tyson, oh, my God, Downey, this is... Ah! Uh, oh! No! Come on! No, no, Come on! 
Martha Stewart spent five months in prison from 2004 to 2005. Ugh. Robert Downey Jr. served All right, so I failed out of one game. Now I'm going to fail out of Edward knowing Tyson things. Was in prison for three years from at least I know I'm good at raiding fighters. At least I know I'm good at raiding fighters. All right. Ego's not taking too huge of a blow here. Absolutely heavenly toilet wine. This is a lot more fun with other players, by the way. I know. I just want to give you an idea. I want to give you an idea of what you don't know Jack is like. Because if you Say don't know Jack, but you to. don't know Jack. Hey. Yep. So, what's going down? Venice, Italy, Edinburgh, Scotland. Venice, sinking. Venice, Italy, known for its canal, it is sinking. Approximately two millimeters every year. Yes. Oceans are rising everywhere. That's right, Cookie. Appears as if it's sinking, but Venice is actually actively going downward. <laughs> Very good. Now I'm only in negative three hundred dollars. Two millimeters a year isn't really all that much. That's why the citizens of Venice have learned to panic very early. In the very old, you don't know, Jack. If you answered a question, fuck you. I remember Cookie would be like, "Oh, fuck me." No, fuck you. And he would just literally close the program. The program would close. You go back to desktop. Why not try That's it. Barely nude. Barely nude. It's, it's about bears. It's about nudity. Oh no, not Dister Jack. Come on. Shit. I'm gonna read I suck at this or that. And for each one, I want you to tell me if it's a, a type, type of build a bear. bear. Okay. Oh. All right, we got if this. Build a bear. Build a bear is a U. If it's Victoria's Secret. Lingerie's A. Got it. Button. All right. All right this should started. be easy, right? Here we go. Lucky Clover Teddy. Yes. Sweet oh no. Pink Flurry Teddy. Oh fuck! I don't know anything. Oh, Cutaway. There we go. Yeah, there we go. That's clearly sexy. No, Midnight Teddy is not Victoria's Secret. Are you fucking kidding me? Ah! All right. At least I'm out of the red. I'm out of the red into the green. Don't shop at Build a Bear. I just feel they reinforce body images that are unrealistic for most bears. Number five. All right. Love the typography, by the way. Love it. Up next, I used all my vacation days on lobster. Mm, that fest. sounds like a good idea. All right, here we go. Lobsters is about lobsters. If the fast food chain Long John Silver's had a calamari special called Squid Pro Quo, what would be an appropriate oh, tagline in their commercials? All of our calamari is free. We'll give you calamari if you give us. Calamari. Oh, there we go. Like Bam. The phrase, Quid Pro Quo. Quid Pro Quo. I'm not stupid. Squid Pro Quo. So squid Pro Quo. You probably need to bring in calamari. Perfect. <laughs> I prefer to eat seafood. We got some uh, caveat mTOR over on the right. We got some, I don't know the Latin phrase for that in the bottom. <laughs> round two. How was round two different than round one? And hopefully you'll do even better in the next Only got $3,000. It's pretty shameful, actually. There's also the screw. Typically in uh, in old uh, You Don't Know Jack games, you could screw your opponents. You would have a screw that you could use. It was on the screen. You could force one of your opponents to answer a question. And in later versions of the game, you could do things like screw with their answers and things like that. Pretty awesome. Take a stab at return to your nearest pantheon. Alright, keeping it with the Greek themes. Or is it wrong? If my with local green? red box okay. were like Pandora's box, what would probably be the only movie left in Ah, oh, it's a disaster fear, movie, hope plus anger, ten, ten things, things I hate about you, about you fear, hope. Management. Hate. Oh no, what? Is it hope? No, it's fear. It's all the things that people fear, or is it all hate? It's hate. I don't know. There are at least eleven things I hate about this answer. No, come on! Ready for this? Anger? Hope? In the story of Pandora's box, Pandora opens said box and releases evil upon the right, world. Right, right, I knew that. remaining at the bottom was hope. No, come on! Let's I didn't know that. No one taught me that in school. Like Pandora's box. I blame my I teachers. I blame Ms. Miller! Golden receiver. Ms. Miller, you let me down. You were supposed to teach me that. <sighs> Here we go. God, no, I'm severely hey, starting to regret getting rid of this thing. How much wood, Chuck? You know, I've been thinking about the universe, and it kind of makes me feel small and alone. You're not alone. You got me, Dunny. Oh, no! Chuck, what is this? What? What? What is this? Not me. I've never heard of this. Oh. This is my ventriloquist puppet, Billy O'Brien. Sometimes I let him ask questions, even though he's a little hard to understand. Wow! I speak perfectly. C come on, man. Let's do this. Stays. One noon orbits the Earth. The moon? Yes, the noon. Okay. That's what I said. The what planet has no noons? Mercury. Mercury. 
Mercury, along with Bam. Venus, has Mercury no doesn't have any moons. moons. I knew that shit. That's easy. That's easy well, peasy, man. All the gas giants got moons. That Even stupid Pluto's got stupid moons. Although, Billy, it's my understanding that they're kind of like co-planet moons, uh, something like that. There's some weird wood stains. Oh, yeah. that's All right, we get it, dude. Chicken, right. I don't even know how many questions there are, by the way. I'm just gonna stop at ten, no matter what happens. You get the idea. You get that this game is like, it's fun, it's frantic. Play against your Coming friends. Up. What am I eating? Mm. Which food is not lying about what animal or body part it is? Buffalo wings. Buffalo. Oh, fuck! No, fuck! I wasn't thinking no. Wings, but not from no. God damn it! No. Oh, I read the question wrong. I read the opposite way. Right it was pig's feet. It was yep. pig's feet. Yep. I read the opposite. You see, that's the thing. That that really sucks. They don't taste as bad as I thought they would. Just have God to remember to damn. The pig socks you know what, we can... <laughs> question... I don't even know if I'm making question 10, but that looks like the Windows XP background right there. Mrs. Miller, How about let me down. Trashes to trashes, junk All right, to junk. not gonna rush it. Just gonna get it right. You're lucky you can't see <laughs> no. what's going on in here because we're about to do a trash question. I remember once getting a comment in one of my articles, like, Wingspan's cool because he's smart. Well, I just proved you wrong, commenter. Just prove that comments are wrong. Time to see whose trash is my treasure this time. Let's take a look. There is a nice pair of boots in size cat. A book called A Parent's Guide to Juvenile Espionage. What? what is this? And an empty bottle of cologne labeled Blue Seduction. Who does this trash belong to? Antonio Banderas, Brad Pitt, George Clooney, or John Stamos? Uh, Puss in Boots is Antonio Banderas, so that's what I'm gonna guess. Antonio Banderas was the voice yes! of the Yes! Not so Puss stupid now, movies. am I, Cookie? The movie Spy Kids, and he has a line of cologne called Blue Seduction. Yeah, I didn't know any of the rest of that stuff. Antonio. All I know is that uh, John Holy Stamos crap, is a washout. Crash Whispers is his name. Brad this guy's the coolest. Antonio Banderas. Antonio Banderas. All right, here we go. Last question. Never let me go. <laughs> oh my God, this is. Way too simple to be funny, but I love it. We have a Rolling Stone gathers no supermodels. Suppose wafer thin Suppose model wafer Kate, Kate Moss, Moss wanted to grow a little. If she were like real Moss, what part of the tree should she lean on in order to grow the most? The highest part of the tree, the driest side oh, of the tree, the south side God. of the tree, or the shadiest part of the tree? It goes on the north side, the driest. Is it dry? No, that doesn't make any sense. The shadiest part is probably it, right? Shadiest. Most kinds of moss grow far better. Yes! Haha! -ha! Alright. Alright, that's it. That's it. You guys get the idea. I don't need to prove how smart or stupid I am. You know what? Don't need to do it. I'm not here to prove my intelligence to you. So we're just going to move on to something else. We're going to play Raiden Legacy. Raiden Legacy. And then that's going to be it for today, ladies and gentlemen. And then you. Then you can have my Ouya. Here we go. Raiden Legacy. How do I explain how good Raiden Legacy is? I can't, so I'm just going to play it. There's nothing to explain. Okay, fine. Download whatever the data is. I have, yes. Thank you for letting me know exactly what the file names of the files you're downloading are, because me playing on the console, this is so important. I don't even want to see that shit on a computer. Don't need to see that anywhere. I, I don't care about GFX data 3.bin. Just download it. Just show me like a, a sexy fighter craft or something like that, or show me some kind of screenshot of the game. Unpacking. I don't need to know about your moving. I don't care if you're moving to an apartment or a condo or anything like that. See Bulukahetsu and success. Let me just tell you something. Raiden Legacy was so good. I spent at least a thousand dollars on this game in the arcade back in the day. Now, of course, it wasn't called Raiden Legacy. We played Raiden Fighters, and you'll see there's Raiden Fighters, Raiden Fighters 2, Raiden Fighters Jet. I don't. The first Raiden, not so great. I feel like Raiden Fighters was the one I was used to. So that's what I'm gonna play. And again, let me. Hopefully, there's more more options than that previous game. All right, game options, video options. Okay, controls. All right. Let's see here. Fire bomb. Got it. That's all you need to know. That is it. Why would you need to know anything else? Auto fire. Um. No. Why would you want? I I see. I feel like in games where you need auto fire, it's just kind of like lame. Like you're really gonna go to that point. Aspect or rate really, original full screen. Okay, original's better because it's going to have the side things, video filtering on, got it. 
shoot 'em ups are an old favorite of mine. I'm not saying that I'm amazing at them. I'm just saying that I love these games. And you're about to see why, ladies and gentlemen. You're about to see why. I hope I picked the right one. Here we go. Yes, this is the right one. I can tell right away. I know a Raiden Fighters game when I see it. Is this literally just going to be emulated straight from it? Yes! With the shitty CGI intro and everything! Nostalgia overload, ladies and gentlemen. I'm reverting back to my middle school self. I'm feeling insecure. I don't know how to talk to girls. I need to lose some weight. And I'm instead of doing all that, I'm just going to go to the arcade and play Raiden Fighters. This is basically it. Oh my god. Soundtrack. The really shitty graphics. Oh, okay, insert coins. I'm just going to hit the O button. Arcade mode. Yeah, why wouldn't I? Yeah, Alright, let's go. Arcade mode. Alright, so here you got different planes. They all have different abilities. Um, so we'll just start with eight. And there's a hidden ability when you hold down your fire button that they don't tell you about on the arcade cabinet. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't care about the fucking mission. The mission is kill bad guys. Oh my god, it's exactly like I remember it! You can get missile upgrades, you get laser upgrades. And every ship has either different missiles, different lasers, and the missile and laser things switches depending on if your missiles are, oh fuck, that was a lot of, that was a lot of missiles, that was a lot of missiles. Alright, here we go, here we go, got a bomb, watch, I'm gonna hold the button down, now watch the sea start glowing, they got on screen, you're like, ah, berserker barrage, motherfuckers, missile time, I'm raining it down, this is what you get for using chemical weapons, motherfuckers, this is what you get, you don't use chemical weapons, gonna bring in the Barack attack, oh, 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 I'm pretty good, actually. I'm not not dead yet. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. That almost got me. That almost got me. That almost got me. Oh, God. Oh, oh! Okay. I'm just getting cocky there. The laser upgrade, also cool. I'm going to pick up the laser upgrade so you get an idea of what it does. The S things add little ships to your side. They do extra damage, and they can kind of, like, help you hit things when you're trailing. And one thing I like to do is charge the special when there's nothing on screen. And then when things go on the screen, like, hit the special. So there we go. And, of course, the special gets more powerful, too. Uh, the more upgrades you get. So I'm going to wait here, wait till it gets the laser upgrades so my lasers get more powerful. The Aegis is very cool, uh, considering simple. And what's great about the Aegis laser upgrade is that because it's homing missiles, you can kind of just move anywhere on the screen you don't have to worry because uh, your shots will continue to hit no matter what. And uh, the main thing you have to do to get good at these kinds of games is to kind of like, you can't look at the screen. I know that sounds weird. Oh, fuck. I'm also out of practice. I'm out of practice. That's why that happened, okay? Oh, uh, what? That didn't kill him? Oh my god, you can't like look at the screen. You have to like look where the shots are gonna be. Ah, I'm bad, I'm bad. I am so bad. I'm gonna lose, I'm gonna lose, I'm gonna lose, I'm gonna lose. Oh god, oh, okay, I wasted a bomb, great. Great, I wasted a bomb. Go to the next area. Go to the next area. Here we go. What's that? No, I don't want to cancel it. Okay, I get it. So you can only play the first level. I'm not paying $4 to do it. Uh, I'm gonna play, I'm gonna play a different ship. Show you the different ship. You get the idea. Okay. Okay, let's see here. No, fuck. Oh, god damn it. I chose the wrong ship. Alright, let's see if I can do this thing without dying this time, alright? Like, fucking channel my middle school skills. Oh, god. I'm already I'm already making some mistakes here. I'm also... D-pad is really not ideal for this. Oh, you can use the analog stick. Alright. Never mind. I'm gonna use the analog stick. It's not the analog stick. It's actually analog control. It's just the fact that... Um, the D-pad, you kind of have to lift your thumb up in order to switch over to right or left. Oh, I hit it already. I already failed. I'm that bad. Also, all of the different planes have different bombs. So, um, there's that. Oh, God, I can let the ships get behind me. The missiles are way more powerful than lasers, but they have to shoot directly in front of you. The lasers are less powerful, but they uh, home in on things. I really do want to show you a different ship. All right, here we go. I guess it's not a ship, it's a plane. The second level of this game is absolutely sick. You know what? Wait a second. I own this game on Xbox. I can show you all the goddamn levels. Um, <laughs> I forgot I bought this game. This game came out on Xbox, although it's called Le Le uh, Raiden Fighters Aces. And it was a little bit different. All right, here's the first boss. Just gonna bomb the fuck out of him. Shock and awe. How do you think? How do you feel about that? Uh, oh, no. All right. Got one more. Got one more. What sucks is you, you get those... Um, power-ups on them. And, th you know, that's the important thing about the bombs. I'm just kind of just dying now. I really suck. All right. You, you drop the bombs on there, and the bombs kind of absorb the bullets, so you don't have to worry about it. All right. I'm going to play a different ship. I'll show you. I'll show you what it's like. All right. Now it's going to ask me to buy the game. Nope. Not giving you money. Not for this demo. They can't deserve it. Plus, I just don't want to put my credit card information on the screen, because I don't know if I've actually put it yet. All right. Here we go. Arcade mode. Okay. So let me see if I remember which one of these is the one that I really like. This thing. There's like one with the insane power, the 
Devastator? I don't know what the hell these things did. One of them shoots this giant snake beam. It might be this one. Let's do it. Alright. Chaser. Laser upgrades on Chaser, if I remember correctly, are sick. There's one that drops like, a constant stream of bombs. You'll see right now, like right off the bat, this thing has like really, really crappy. Here we go. Here we go. Look at this. So it's got this kind of weird ass homing laser, um, which looks cool to start. But then it's really when you get like more laser upgrades, it gets absolutely sick. Get a bomb. The other cool thing about getting the um, the little S guys, the little guys that follow you around, is that they can absorb shots for you. So especially if you don't have a way to avoid the shots, you can kind of like force them into your, uh, you can kind of throw them away for you. They're like gonna take one for the team involunt involuntarily. Ah, oh, it's a lot of bullets. Oh my god. Uh, it's not that many bullets, really. Played a lot of bullet hell games that are a lot worse than this. I don't even remember what the hell the missile upgrade for this thing does. Alright, shit, those things are behind me. The, the last place you want is these things to be behind you. Oh, okay, so now I'm gonna charge my special and see what it does. Eat it! Oh, snake beam of doom! Yes! Oh, I love the snake beam of doom. I love the snake beam of doom. Oh, god damn it. I apparently also like dying snake beam. All right, here's the missiles. Oh, it's got the sidewinder missiles. It's got the sidewinder missiles. Eat missiles. What do you think about that? Huh? 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 What do you think about this? Oh, oh, you got missiles? I got missiles, bro. Here's some missiles for you. Missiles from the misses. Oh, fuck, that is cool. And the ship's way faster than the other ship. I'm going to drop a bomb there so I don't take any damage from those things. Missile overload! Oh shit! Here we go, 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 missiles! Ah! Oh! No, I ran right into that. I ran right into it. Should have backed up. Should have backed that. Should have backed it up. Alright, alright, that's it. I'm done. You get the idea. This game is awesome. As far as winning my Ouya console goes, here's what you gotta do. You have to go to toptiertactics.com, big friggin' surprise, alright? We have a contest thread yeah. there. I want you to go into the article, go into the thread, go to the comments, and leave a comment yeah. telling me what game you would like to play on Ouya. It can be a real game that you've already seen is yeah. on the console, or it could be a hypothetical game, a game that you think would be really cool to yeah. port to the system. I don't care what it is, I just need to get rid of this thing before it murders yeah. me in my sleep. Alright everyone, uh, thanks for watching the video, I'll see you next time. Cheers. Yeah.